Today, I am trying a rather unique noodle dish made by a family whose business goes back more than 50 years. So they were able to use their noodle expertise to dream up a super hybrid. Fishball noodle plus bakute equals bakut noodle. But disclaimer, this isn't actually fishball noodles. It's just the noodle part. But the family started off as fishball noodle sellers. Can definitely taste a hint of the cinnamon, the garlic, the ginger. Really good quality dark soy sauce. Not too herbal, just really savoury with a sweet round note at the end. And there's a little hint of that peppery kick. Good broth. Yum. Hey, look at that. Big chunk of pork with the cartilage encircled by tender meat. Mmm. It is tender. It's really taken on all the flavours of the stock, but it also has a good chew. What I also like about this broth is that they include, besides the pork rib, tau pok, which is dry tofu. These are like little food sponges. And as you chew, it releases the flavour. It's like slow release in my mouth. Yum! And I was a bit cheeky. I asked for the bean curd skin or the tau ki. So good! I ordered the mee pok because that's what Madam Fang says is the most popular amongst her customers. And they always go for the dry version. And of course, you cannot do a good bowl of mee pok without this crispy fried lard. <laughs> that is the perfect bite. Wow, it's so good. So good, so good. The noodles are pew pew and springy al dente. All that sauce is just clinging to it. And she uses a little bit of her braising liquid to flavour these noodles. And it's a wonderful combination. I wonder why nobody else has thought of it. So for those in the know of this place, great. Because it is quite far out in Sembawang. But I just feel like everybody else needs to come and try this unique combination here at Malu Malu Wasing Bakut Noodle. And opposite to their name, there's nothing to be shy about. This is something to be shouted about. Mmm.